Welcome to my channel! In today's video, I have another hair experiment for you. We are going to see whether lemon juice lightens hair, how much it can lighten, and whether this method is worth trying. I already have a video on my channel where I tested 8 different home methods of hair lightening. In that experiment, I tried lemon juice alone over 3 months, and it gave noticeable quite nice effects. This time I want to add sun exposure to the experiment and see to what extent lemon and sunlight can lighten hair. I will also check whether this lightening damages hair. For this experiment I'm using organic lemon juice. I prepared three glasses. One with 100% lemon juice, one with lemon juice mixed equal with water, and one with pure water. I prepared four strands of dark blonde hair. The strand marked in orange is for lemon juice mixed in equal amounts with water. The yellow strand will test undiluted lemon juice. Normally, I wouldn't recommend using undiluted lemon juice on hair because it can be damaging. But since this is an experiment, I want to see how much lightening occurs and its effect on the hair's condition. The blue strand will check whether water alone is enough to lighten hair in the sun and the brown strand is a control sample which I will keep indoors away from the sunlight. I dipped each strand in its liquid and exposed it to the sun. Always trying to use a dark background so the strands would heat up, just like naturally hair does in the sun. I kept each strand outside every sunny day for at least an hour, but mostly for a few hours. To make the experiment more accurate, I decided to prepare two additional hair strands. I will apply 100% lemon juice to the strand with red color and diluted lemon juice to the purple one. But I will keep both at home away from the sun to see if sunlight is truly necessary for hair lightening. My first observation was that lemon juice makes hair very sticky. While the diluted juice allows the hair to return to a relatively normal appearance after combing, pure lemon juice leaves the hair incredibly sticky and hard to comb, making it necessary to wash the hair after each use. After the first application, there was no noticeable difference. I compared all the strands and you can see them here. I continued the experiment, keeping the first strands in the sun and the others at home. After 8 sessions, I noticed some differences. The strand with undiluted lemon juice was slightly lighter. The diluted juice strand, in my opinion, didn't show much change. But interestingly, the strand soaked in water only and exposed to the sun seems to be the lightest.
for the strands kept at home, there was no difference. Here is a closer look in sunlight. Judge for yourself and let me know if you see any difference in the strands after those 8 applications. Of course, I continued the experiment for several more weeks. After two and a half months, the hair was noticeably lighter. To my surprise, the strand treated with water alone and sand was the lightest. The hair treated with lemon juice also showed warmer shades compared to the strands treated only with water. The indoor strands with concentrated and diluted lemon juice lighten very slightly, if at all, compared to those kept in the sun and the difference is not very noticeable. For this experiment, I used darker hair strands than in my previous one, which might explain why the earlier strand lightens significantly even without sun exposure. So, lemon juice does work for hair lightening and sun exposure helps speed up the process and achieve more visible results. Of course, every hair type is different and may vary in shades, so lemon juice may lighten hair differently, producing warmer or cooler tones depending on your hair color. In my opinion, there is no real difference between undiluted and diluted lemon juice for lightening after this two and a half months. So if you want to avoid the sticky feeling and tangled hair, use diluted lemon juice. Once the hair dries, it's easier to comb and the strands are no longer stuck together. During this whole experiment, I didn't use conditioner on the samples, only rinsing them with pure water or a gently diluted shampoo. I wanted to see how lemon and sun would affect the hair. An interesting thing was that hair treated with lemon juice became shiny and silky while the water-only strand was a little bit rough. I thought lemon might dry out the hair, but it was actually smooth and pleasant to the touch. This could be for two reasons. Lemon juice has an acidic pH between 2 and 3, which may smooth hair by closing the cuticles. While pure lemon juice may be too strong for skin and scalp, the hair seems to be fine with that, as the hair strand with diluted lemon wasn't as silky as the strand with pure lemon juice. The second reason could be the sugar content. 
Sugars aren't great in our diets, but actually moisturizes the skin and hair as addition to cosmetics and beauty treatments. As I mentioned before, the hair strands treated with lemon juice become very sticky, which means that the water evaporates in the sun, leaving just a sugar coat on the hair. This not only moisturizes and nourishes the hair, but also protects the hair from the drying effect of the sun. This sticky layer may also explain why the lemon-treated hair was less lightened than the water-only hair. In the final clips, I want to show you how the hair strands look after I apply the conditioner on them, rinse it out and then let the hair air dry. The water-only strand becomes soft and smooth after the conditioner, so it seems that the simple step is helping to keep the hair moistured while lightening in the sun. That's why if you want to try lemon juice in the sun or just water and sun method, I recommend using a conditioner afterward and applying oil, especially on your ends. I enjoyed doing this experiment. We all know lemon juice can lighten hair, but I've learned so much more along the way and I hope you did too. If you want a quicker and more effective hair lightening method, check out my other videos where I apply hydrogen peroxide on my hair. I also try burinses, which slightly lightened my hair and added an incredibly glossy finish. Let me know in the comments if this experiment was useful and if you like the results. Which lightening method would you like me to try next? Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video. Bye bye!